Hey guys, Seven WWE Rocks here, and the big news on like the dirt sheets, the wrestling websites, and all. Uh, Cody Rhodes possibly heading to TNA. Uh, it sounds like it's gonna happen. Uh, you know, I don't want to be one of those people that believe everything on the internet, but Dave Meltzer apparently is reporting that Cody Rhodes is going to be headed to uh, TNA. It's just a matter of time. Um, he has not signed an actual deal with them. He's going to be able to do TNA, Ring of Honor, uh, without actually being signed to either company, which I'm really happy about. I think that's great. I think that's like the perfect thing for an independent wrestler, you know, in today, in 2016, uh, to, you know, be able to wrestle wherever he wants and not be held down by a contract. Um, also with TNA, I would definitely do that because, um, if you sign a contract and they start doing stupid stuff with your character or whatever, you're thinking, gosh, I wish I hadn't signed the contract. So I think it's just a little testing with them. Maybe he will end up signing a contract and that'd be cool too. So Cody Rhodes in TNA, they're reporting that he's possibly, or he's supposed to face, uh, Michael Bennett. That's going to be his first feud, um, coming into TNA, which I'm okay with. Not that excited about it because, um, you know, Cody Rhodes just had this, uh, awesome, you know, great, great weekend with uh, Bola, PWG. He had uh, two great matches I've been hearing. I heard, uh, I forget which one, but a uh, few people were actually tweeting that's probably the best Cody Rhodes match they've ever seen. So he's having some of the best matches of his career. He's versing Kurt Angle. He's versing Mike Bennett on the independent scene and all that stuff. Um, you know, he's doing all this great stuff. But I was just kind of disappointed because if he versus Mike Bennett, it seems more of a character type feud instead of an actual wrestling type feud. When I see a guy feuding with Mike Bennett, I don't see them pulling out like four or five star matches, you know, doing all this great stuff. Um, that's no disrespect to Mike Bennett. I think he's a pretty solid wrestler, but I just don't really get excited for his matches as of late. Um, I just haven't, you know, thought he's like the great, you know, puts on these great, great matches. So... I think he's a great heel, great character though, so that's, you know, awesome, but I just feel like wrestling-wise, I was a little disappointed. I want Cody Rhodes to go in and have some awesome, awesome matches in TNA. That's what I want. Not really character-driven, um, and I know TNA is a very big character-driven uh, company, and I'm not saying character is meaningless. I just wish he would be in more of a feud with, like, a guy that can, like, go, like Eddie Edwards or, um, can't really think of someone else. Maybe Drew Galloway, you know, that'd be kind of interesting since he's heel um, now. I mean, I don't know, some somebody like that, I guess. Um, but it, it, it does have a lot of possibilities because Mike Bennett is, of course, with Maria. So that means Cody Rhodes would have to have Eden in the feud, his uh, wife. So I think that'd be really interesting if they, uh, you know, you know, all four of them got, came up with some great stuff. You know, Eden and Maria getting into it while Bennett and Cody Rhodes are, you know, kicking each other's butts um, all over the impact zone. So... I'm, you know, the feud, I'm not really, like, looking forward to. And, again, it's not, like, solid. You know, they could bring him in and do something totally different. I kind of hope they do. Um, I would love to see him go after the new championship, the grand championship. Um, maybe not world title right away, but, um, you know, this is why I wish they had the King of the Mountain title still. Uh, because now that they have the grand championship, now it's, like, a stipulation, though. It's, like, the MMA-style rules, and I think that's stupid. They just had the King of the Mountain title. It could just be that little title that... Guys in the X, guys that can't be in the X division at least can win it before they go in the world title. I still think they should have never gotten rid of like the TV title or whatever and changed it all up. Um, but let me know in the comment section what do you think about Cody Rhodes going to TNA? Do you think it's a good fit? Do you think he should stay away? Let me know. I'd love to hear it. Um, two subscribers, yes, two subscribers. As I'm making this video, hopefully I pass it by then, by the time it's uploaded or whatever. But two subscribers away from 400 subscribers. We are so close. Please give me over and a lot over because I don't want to, you know, make a Q&A or whatever and then someone, you know, unsubscribes it and it's down to $3.99 again. Please, I would hate that. So, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Follow me on Twitter, at 7 Rocks. Um, SmackDown tonight. I have not been enjoying SmackDown as of late at all, but maybe uh, Kurt Hawkins shows up. That'd be great. Heath Slater and Rhino, they're the two people that are freaking keeping me watching that show and AJ Styles. Thanks so much for watching. As always, have a great day.